Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Late Nights with Steampunk Cutie. How are my, all my fellow mechanicals doing today, tomorrow, whatever time zone it is for you? I hope you're all happy, healthy, and well. And tonight we are continuing on. I keep shaking the table, sorry. Uh, tonight we're finishing, well, hopefully finishing up the clothespin jar. Um, I'm doing painting the clothespin, so it might not be done tonight, but we'll see. So I've got paint and I'm ready to paint and chit chat and catch up and all of that fun stuff. So yeah, that's what we're doing tonight. Um, I did bring the can in the other one I made. So if anybody does not know what I'm making, I can show it. It's over there. So um, if you're curious, but if not, that's cool too. But yeah, we've got a whole thing of them to paint so that's what we're doing um we're doing red and black fun colors my favorite scheme i love red and black like you know so that's what we're doing tonight think I can this is dry paint in here does it will that affect it if I put new black paint in there I don't know if that will affect it I hope not but for something tell me I don't think it will or will it I don't know decisions decisions and this this is like glaring but it's still glaring it's okay um, it is what it is, right? All right, so I just cleaned my brush. We're going to start off with, since it's like every other one, I think I'm going to count out how many I have and do that many. Um, so I might, I think I'm going to start off with the red. Okay, so we have, I'm just going to sort these out real quick. Uh, yeah. All right, there we go. Okay, so these are all going to be red. She has a half day tomorrow, so, and she's trying to get out of going all completely because it's only half day, but since she's failing math, she has to go. It almost looks pink. Doesn't that almost look like pink? Maybe not. I don't know. It does look, it has a pink tone to it. But anyway, doesn't that, maybe it's just the lighting. Maybe it's the lighting. Anywho, um, yeah, I've got my tray. Hopefully that will help with the drying process a bit. Um, I'm gonna turn off this fan and keep that one on. It gets really, really hot in here. So like I have like two fans. So, all right, so we're not doing the bottom back, bottom back, because this is going to be glued to the can. So I'm just doing the, 
the front and the sides. Ooh. <laughs> oh, right in between. It's going to be another messy night. At least I don't have to cut any more wood, hopefully. Because, um, gave myself a, like, blister, like, all right in here. It hurts so bad. <laughs> oh well, right? What are you gonna do? My bathing suit came in, so I'm excited about that. I was worried because it was on like a uh, back order and wasn't sure if it was gonna actually make it. So but it came and it's cute to boot. So, there's gotta be a different way to do this, right? I mean, oh well, I'm gonna have to get dirty. No choice, right? <gasps> no, I don't wanna do the back. Cause I need, um, the back not to be done. Because I think it'll be, oh, the glue will stick better to it, I think. Oh, well. It'll be what it'll be. Uh, and there I am painting the back. <laughs> I think I might have to do two coats. What do you guys think? Do you think two coats? Ooh, gosh. Do you think two coats? I'm getting it all over. Do you think two coats will will do? Or should I do one? Just probably do one, see how it works, right? That's probably how we're going to roll on that one. Ooh. This is where I need that tinier brush. I think the tinier brush would work better on this. Painting like this. There you go. Okay. This red looks so good. It's definitely not pink. It just looks pink. I think by lighting. This is where I wish I had something to hold things with so it's not like getting all over, but I guess that's the name of the game. Okay. It's not too horrible. I mean, right? We love paint. 
Yes, we do. We love paint. How about you? <laughs> oh my gosh, help me. I pulled my... We were looking for study rings, right? In the store. Because uh, she's looking for her studs to put in her ears um, for her, her dance that's coming up or whatever. And I pulled my, we're looking for some studly studs, like studly. And the lady at the store, the employee, she was like, she went like this and turned her head and started laughing. And I was like, oh yeah, I know, that was lame. <laughs> okay. I know, it was corny and lame at the same time. But it did make her smile. As lame as it was, it did make her smile. But I thought it was funny. So yeah. Ooh. I might need to Oh gosh jeez. Gosh jeez. I um book my flight for Florida. So I am heading to the beach like in a month. Actually a little less than a month now. So I'm excited. Um, it didn't go through. I thought I booked the tickets beforehand and apparently got an email stating that they were not actually brought. And I was like, oh, okay. So they're officially brought now. They were a little more than I wanted to pay for, but that's okay. And yes, I'll be careful of the Florida man. <laughs> Who had no idea what... To the extent that was until yesterday. Thank you, Durst. Not sure if you're watching or not, but thank you. <laughs> but, uh, okay, so the painting. This one's a little bent. Can you see? This one goes down in. I think it'll be all right. I mean, it's not perfect, right? It's not supposed to be perfect. And then I have a, a shellac, like a poly. I don't know if I should do it with polyurethane or the, I have like a, what's it called? Um, a paint that's like, a slack, I guess, over it. A, a cover, like, seals it. A sealer. So. And then, like, when I'm in Florida. Because I'll be gone for, like, two weeks. So I probably won't be streaming as much. I will try. I'll probably do a lot of crocheting nights because usually that's all I can do at my sister's house. So it'll probably be quiet nights, uh, crochet nights. Um, if I can. So I'll bring my computer. 
I need to find a um a case for my computer, my laptop. I love this paint, this, uh, I think it's chalk paint, isn't it? Yeah, chalk paint, because it really covers really well. I feel like it covers pretty well. I wonder if I'm supposed to do this too, probably. Yeah, because it's going to be connected, so I probably want to do that part too. So pretty. It would have been cool if I can do like a like black and red on the same stick. So like black, red, black, or red, black, red. You know what I mean? That would be kind of cool, but I feel like that would be too much. I think I need a smaller product for this. That's okay though. What was today? Today was a good day ish. Got a lot to do. What grocery shopping? I hate grocery shopping. Who's with me? Does anybody else like grocery shopping? Besides the fact that you get awesome food sometimes, but mm -hmm. it sucks to do it. You know what I mean? Sometimes. I don't know. I mean, I guess I could have ordered it and had it sent to my house, like someone drive it to my house, but I feel like I don't, I don't like to do that. You know what I mean? I like to go in the stores usually to look, but today I was not feeling it. I literally just wanted to be home. I don't know why. Oh, you can see the green through this red. Look at that. You can see it like. I didn't know if I want my nails red <laughs> either. <laughs> They're painted red right here. Oh, 
Oh yeah, so I was telling, telling you guys my bathing suit came in. And for once, like, because usually I don't find myself looking nice or whatever in bathing suits. It's just the bathing suit, right? I just have to, I have to have it for a beach or a pool, pool or pond or bike or whatever the hell you're doing. So I feel like I just have to have it, but I actually like the way it looked on me. So I was quite happy with it. And it's usually not, I don't usually feel that way. Oh. There you go. So yeah. Did you guys have a Polaroid camera when you grew up? Or did your parents? I think I, was, I remember the Polaroid, Polaroid camera, but I think I was like too young to like experience it, like for myself. Like I don't think I ever used one. I know my parents did, like, because I have photos of proof that I was being taken pictures of with a Polaroid camera. But. Like, it's something I physically never used myself. I know how it works. I know what it looks like and all that, but... We can do like, let's see. Isn't that the rage these days? The little crisscross, I think. I don't know. <laughs> oh my gosh, it looks stupid. That's okay. I was having those la days today. I'm ruining the brush by doing that. These are cheap brushes. They're like a dollar. Can't beat a dollar for four brushes. You know what I mean? I wonder if I just did this, would that be? No, I don't think so. Oh my gosh. I made another, um, after stream, I've stayed on, like, just continued crafting. And I made, um, a 
another guitar pick. Um, and I found some glitter that I haven't, I forgot I had. So I, tried, I wanted to use it because I wanted to see what it looked like, of course. So I made two guitar picks and um, I'm putting them, putting charms on them. Like I have fairy charms because I think they'll be really cute earrings. So that's what I'm doing. I need to make a third one for a bracelet so like I have like a set, but I'll have to do that later. Ooh. Oh, no, no, no. I have to cover that up. I'll show you guys in a minute. Um, I want to at least finish the red real quick so that I can get them drying and then I can go back in with the black, the black ones, and then go back with the red again. And then seal it. I wonder if I seal this with nail polish remover, or with nail polish, not remover. Do you think they'll? It'll seal it well because it's kind of like a poly, like a it would be kind of like a poly coat, right? Or is it not the same? Would it react weird with the paint and the wood? What do you guys think? I don't know. I'm kind of curious to find out, but I don't think it'll ruin anything, right? Or will it? Decisions and questions, huh? I don't know. I mean, I guess I could probably paint a stub over here that I have leftover stubs and find out, right? Maybe. I don't know. Any way in on anything? I don't know yet. I imagine it would be fine, but I don't want it touching. Okay. Somebody look at out me. But, um, but yeah. Oh my gosh. The song was funny. With the bullet in my head. Okay. Do some funky, fancy quacha. Hey. Want the paintbrush? Don't put the paint on me. Who the f in their right mind does shit like that? Me, me. Oh, I was kung fu. I'm done. Mm. 
been a while. Now I'm just getting sloppy. Like, just get this done. <laughs> That's probably why I was never such a good painter. It's like, if anything, or I got no patience for things. It's like, let's just, just cover this shit up and let's get it done with. How many people are like that? I bet you guys are, some of you are like that too. Oh, wait. It's been a while. See, getting sloppy makes me not do things good, does it? Yeah. It does. But it's like, all right, let's do this shit. Did I do? No, I did not. I was about to be like, did I just do what I think I just did? I did not. Just to disappear when I'm with you. Like, no, cutie, no, don't do it. Oh! Almost I feel this way. Just make this go away. Just want to go like this. Have you guys ever drank paint water? Like thinking that it was like your water and you drank it because, like I said, like you thought it was water and then you're like, oh shoot, and <laughs> it has paint in it. I done that once before. Um, yes, I was littler though, of course, because like you know, although as an adult I could see myself doing that if I got like reached for the wrong thing, if like a glass or something that was there, like always there, and you switch things up and you forget, you know what I mean? But uh, I've done that when I was little. It was gross. I got some mistaken um, chocolate chunk in the bottom of my chocolate milk. I mistaken it as um, chunk of chocolate, and it wasn't. It was a bug. That was disgusting, too. It was a pin one of those uh, your wigs, pincher bug type things. I was like, oh. I spit that up real quick. It was gross. Let me just say. It was nasty to the T. Tell me I'm not the only one who's ever done that. It's okay. It's okay. You guys don't have to tell me. It's cool. <laughs> uh, so now, like, now I'm, like, extra careful when it comes to, like, things left out like especially during the summer because you never know
But yeah. We don't ever recall doing that, and I'm 63. <laughs> Nothing, not at all. <laughs> hey, why not, right? <laughs> it's a first for everything. <laughs> Hi, welcome in. How are you? What is up? How you doing? I guess there's a, yeah, first for everything, right? It was definitely not my shining moment. I mean, I was uh, younger, but. It's what you get for leaving your chocolate milk on the counter in summer. Just painting these sticks. But yeah, um, and then like I was, uh, cause we did the newspaper, we delivered the newspaper. Um, we had two routes and because, you know, my mom wanted to teach us responsibility and, you know, kind of get a feel for what, like, a job would be, even though it's kind of like a, like all kids, well, not all kids, but now, but I mean, back then, all kids had some type of, like, newspaper or, you know, like a little job or something. And so um, we had two routes and we delivered the newspapers. And um, we walked. And um, when I uh, when I was still a in elementary school, I did try a chunk of Perino try food. It was very plain. Was it? Oh, that would be gross. At least it was dry. It didn't have like did it like so like it didn't didn't really have a a taste at all then if it was plain or did it like did you like revolt did you like want to throw it up or something or no it was just like eh. so i was uh doing delivering newspapers and i was eating a lemon cookie. It was yellow and it was a lemon cookie. And oh, is that all the red? Oh, yeah, that's all the red. And I, um, a bee, I, I think it was more than a bee. I don't think it was a full bee because I think because it stung me like four or five times. But I think it was like more of like a wasp or something. Um, it flew into my mouth as I was eating the cookie and it stung me inside my mouth like four times. And my, like, I swelled up so bad. I didn't finish the route. Like, I had to run back home because I swelled up like a balloon. Um, I had to go to the doctors and everything. Like, yeah, it was bad. But, um, but it didn't cut off my breathing, but I did have to go to the doctor. Um, we, uh, we were in the country until shortly before I turned 10, so we just did chores and helped in the big vegetable. Oh, okay. Cool. All right, time for the black. What is this paint? Oh, that's not this eyebrow or eyelash. Okay. You had a vegetable garden? So like, did you have, what kind of vegetables did you have? Did you like to have all kinds? See, we tried to do a vegetable, a small vegetable garden where I am. Like, 
like a couple years ago. And we got tomatoes, we've got green beans, we got peppers, and then what else did we try to do? Um, there was one other, I can't remember what the other one was, but and then we tried to all of that turned out fine, right? But then the next year we tried to replant everything back again and it didn't grow. Like nothing came back, like everything died and like so I was like we were kind of like bummed and defeated. So we were just like, well, screw it. We're not doing oh cucumbers. That was the other thing. Um, so it didn't work. And um and we've come to come to come to find out that we are definitely not garden people. <laughs> I don't know what we did wrong or um later on come to find out that we were supposed to like re what was it like someone said like one of our friends who were is a who gar farmed and gardened like their whole life um they said that you needed to put stuff back into the soil in order for it to keep because you're pulling all the nutrients and something like something to that effect out when you planted the vegetables and all that and so we never put it back in so therefore all our stuff didn't grow the second year because it was out of the nutrients from the year before or something like that. I don't know. That's how they s explained it. So I was like, oh, okay. <laughs> Makes sense, I think. Decades later, I delivered on a motor. Decades later, I delivered on a motor new new newspaper route. They called us independent contractors, even though we did exactly what they said to do and how and where they said to do it in their facility so they could pay us less than minimum wage. Oh, wow. That's crazy. That's kind of messed up. Okay. I'm going to try it. I'm going to try putting new paint in old black paint. Like, it's dried. So I'm, I hope it doesn't, like, affect the paint. But we'll see, I guess. Isn't that how, like, it's kind of scummy that they did that, though, right? I mean, now when you think about it, it's kind of like, but when you were younger, you're like, eh, it, it didn't matter. It didn't care as much. So, like, now it's like, that was a real shitty type thing to do. You know what I mean? We had a variety of vegetables and shift them around each year. Oh, we did that so the beans could get nutrients back into the soil, but also so insects and Belights, belights didn't hit the same part of the garden. What's a belight? I don't know what that is. Oh, and shifted them around each year. We did that so the beans could. Okay, okay. That was way much. Okay, I think I'll use it though. And then we have all of these to do. We're gonna turn this around so I can just place them there. Okay, there we go. Tomato squash of a few varieties, sweet corn, spinach, leaf, lettuce, sweet peas. Oh, cute. Okay. Oh, I see. Okay. You did um sweet corn? Like, did you have like a field of corn or is it just like a little section of tall corn? Mom canned tomatoes and dill pickles. Because they didn't require a pressure cookie. Cook cookie. <laughs> pressure cookie. <laughs> oh, okay. I tried. We tried pressure cooking. Um, we tried um, canning. Didn't work either. I don't know if we did it right.
Because we really did. We tried one year. Like, we wanted to, like, be sustain- sustainable. Like, like if we wanted to make sure we could survive off whatever or whatever. You know what I mean? For the winter or whatever. But it didn't work out that well. But I mean, it's a good quality to have, though. Like, if you are able to be a green thumb and, like, be able to do all that, that is, like, awesome. I'm sure it's learnable. I'm sure everybody could actually do it. It's just, you know who have patience and know what they're doing, you know what I mean? Or learn exactly what you're supposed to do. This paint is a little more, maybe it's because my brush is wet. I was like, this is a little more runny. I, uh, yeah, we ju uh, just had a small pet, okay. Planted in a square of road because it's one. Oh, it wind's pollinated. Oh, okay. I didn't know corn pollinated. You have to, you have to get sweet corn into boiling water within a half hour of picking it, or the sugar turns to starch and stops. Oh, I did not know that. Oh, interesting. That's very interesting. That's why none of us ever buy corn on the cob at a grocery store. Because it's not sweet, right? Is that... Well, because you also grow it. Is corn, like, a hard thing to grow? All plants with seeds are pollinated uh, somewhat. Okay. Interesting. Not sure why I didn't know that, but <laughs> there's there are tricks to everything. Yeah, I would imagine so. Absolutely. I would agree with that. So is corn easy to grow then? Like sweet corn? And I guess you got to know the seasons and things are that has to be put in when and where, you know. Uh, I don't know what you considered hard. Okay, we've always, we always were able to pick corn to, to four weeks during the summer. Okay, four weeks during the summer. Okay. It needs plenty of sun. Oh, I have beautiful trees in my backyard. That makes it too shady. Gotcha. Yeah, we have no trees in our backyard. Like, it's literally open. But I do live in a state that's kind of... Um, I mean, we get sun, but it's like... It's... Sometimes there we go weeks without sun, so like uh, you know what I mean. Not four, not four weeks for week. Oh, four, four weeks. Oh, okay. Sorry, miss. I read that.
I'm actually kind of tempted to see if we could plant sweet corn. You might be able to grow Swiss chard, which is sort of like like if spinach and celery had a baby. Interesting. I don't think I've ever had that either. That would be a weird combo, I think. That's a weird combo. What do you use it for? Like salads? Like down there. We picked a few leaves off each plant whenever we wanted to cook some. Okay, the plant would keep producing for months from, from spring to through fall. Oh, that's good. That's really good. Like, I like um, when plants um, can grow in multiple seasons. Because I, especially flowers, I hate that they, like, die at a certain season and you're like, okay. But I guess that's where you would offset things, right? Like, know which months go with which months and plan accordingly so you have something constantly growing or moving through. Oh, I almost dropped that. I'm not sure I remember area accurately, but I think we even had some char plants that lived through winter. Ooh. Did you like bring them in if you did if the, if if you did or just left them out? Wish I had like a little gripper. <laughs> I could just grip this and hold it. Uh, no, all of our gardens were planted. Oh, in the ground. Okay, I got you. I got you. Quick question. You might not know, and that's okay. I was just curious. What, what, I just want to know kind of what your opinion is, you know, of the barrel gardens, the ones that, like, people build in barrels do they work well or or is it just better to stick it right in the ground if i'm being in, in, too invasive let me know <laughs> i'm just generally curious I've always um, wondered about the barrel gardens or the um, like the hay bale ones or any of that sort. I've always wondered if they're actually worth doing. Are they even better or that sort of thing? Hold on a minute. If you want flowers that live through winter and bloom in spring, well, it's odd that calling someone a pansy is to say they they weak and soft. Pansies live through winter. Oh. I I didn't know pansies live through winter. Really? 
That I did not know. I love pansies. They're so pretty. It is odd. That totally is odd. Because that's like a strength flower. To me, that would be show like strength and character. You know what I mean? Sally, they also are also annual. So they've so that after they bloom in the spring, they eventually die off. Oh, yeah. Maybe it's not all varieties of pansies. I should probably clean my hands because the red is coming off on my clothespin and I don't want the red on there. Hold on, let me... Mm. Interesting. Not all varieties. I mean, that's fair enough, though, right? I mean, I need water. I don't want to stick my hands in the dirty water, but I might. Geraniums and our perennials. Are they a hardy flower then? Because I do marigolds, because marigolds, they're like a summer, fall flower, and I can keep those alive. Those things are stubborn and strong, like I can't kill them. I do not have a green thumb. I seem to kill my flowers. Um, as long as they're not, uh, like, in the ground. But if they're picked and in a vase, I can keep those bad boys pretty long. <laughs> I don't understand. Um, only bloom in winter, okay, if they are placed in a cold room or by a cold window. Oh, interesting. Okay. I'm trying to get this. A little bit of this red off because I need to not get red on my black. I also like, um, I know daffodils are only a springtime flower and they only like bloom for a short amount of time, but I love daffodils. They're so pretty. I wish they could last a long time. And I really wish that the, um, I feel weird washing my hands in dirty water. I kept a pineapple plant alive for over 50, what, whoa, did it keep, did it like actually grow awesome pineapples? When, then for a month, my best roommate ever and I each thought the, the other was, oh, and I lost three house plants that way, including the pine. Oh no, that's brutal, man. 50 years kept alive and then, oh, that's dang. That must have been heartbreaking. Like, that would have been, like, you know what I mean? That would have, like, I would have been so irritated with myself. <laughs> okay. It's better than, let me just see this one over here. Okay. Fly away. All right, this should help with the whole not getting it all over. I finally got an avocado tree to 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 last last a year. Oh wow, and grow four four feet tall. Whoa, I've been I've. I've been fired, and if the people in the building watered it with plain water, it will die of root rot. Oh. That's so sad. Whoa, whoa, whoa. It was, it was just starting another root of, Oh, after drooping 
to the one side. Oh, that's so sad. Poor avocado tree. They had given me hope. It that had given me hope. Uh -huh. That's awesome that it gave you hope, though. This is bad things the way you hit me. The way that you play me. I don't miss you, I miss the misery. I mean I lost my job because no one knew how to manage my this um that sucks. I'm sorry for that. It was even an unusual, unusually good employer. It was even an unusually good employer. Oh, man. That's why I, I want to make a living as a web cartoon oh that's pretty cool a web cartoonist that would that's freaking awesome being before my own before my own boss right oh wait i need to do it at the top okay there you go that's better That is so cool. A web cartoonist? Like drawing or like animating? Like that whole that like that whole type of thing? That's freaking cool. Trouble is there are thousands of comic strips and only do a dozen of really good ones and people don't want to wade through them all looking for good stuff drawing not animating oh okay not anim oh okay i can see how yeah i can see that That's cool, though. A local successful Turk cartoonist says it takes a minimum three years of regular reliable update before a new Web comic site builds. Wow. Significant traffic. Minimum three years. Oh, that's a little, that's a little bit of a, that's a little bit of a much. I've tried building a site myself. I even completed a certificate in web design. All, all it did was make me a really good client. Uh, oh, man. I have four people volunteering their time, but it's always only their spare time. So I've been waiting for over a year and haven't seen much development. Oh. So there's like no pressure pressure on it because it's volunteering. Try to get that glow covered. Twenty 
torment driving me insane. I can't afford to pay anyone. Okay, I was considering paying one guy, but I couldn't get him to discuss the project enough. I don't want anyone to work until we both know exactly what the other is thinking. No, I absolutely can agree with that 100% because, like, I mean, it's not maybe not the same exact thing, but, like, in beauty, like, doing clients' hair, like, haircuts and stuff, like, you know, hairdressers, they cut your hair according to what you've discussed, like, this is how you want it, this is what you want done, blah, 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 like, can you do it, yes or no, like, that type, all that discussion, and then they go and cut it completely, I mean, it might not be the same thing, but it's similar, um, and they go ahead and cut it a whole different whatever, so, like, I, when I was cutting hair, I like to make sure that, like, I knew exactly like no fussy games no because they're gonna in the end they're the ones that are gonna have to wear it and you know show it off and be comfortable and feel pretty and whatnot you know what i mean because you can make or break someone by one wrong snip you know, you know what i mean and you're not living with that that like that they are so i like to make sure um that everybody was satisfied so i would totally agree with your thing Hair is a great example of the same. Okay. <laughs> but I totally get that. Yeah. And it's after one o'clock a.m. here. I need to get ready for bed. All right. Well, thank you for hopping in and chit-chatting with me. I, well, I'm glad to see you back. Hope to continue to see you back. I hope you have a great night. Yeah, it's like one after one here, too. <laughs> we must be in the same time zone. Possibly. But, yeah. I hope you have a great night's sleep. And if you have any pictures of your um, um, cartoon drawings, I'm, unless you don't want to show, but I would love to see them. Can I take it all away? I'll, I'll always look to see if your channel is in the list with the little red <laughs> indicating your name. Okay. <laughs> he calls it a meatball. That's cute. I like that. Good, I look forward to seeing you again. Okay. I'm still getting red on this. Not as bad as before, but sucks, okay. That's gonna be a problem, isn't it? This little blue spot. I wonder if I can, I still need to figure out if I can just put nail polish. No, I don't wanna ruin it with nail polish. Might be, might be better though. Unless you you have a Discord server, the only way I could show you my cartoon would be to post sort Twister links, and I don't want your rules for promotion. Are um, I do have a Discord? I can um, here. Hold on. Uh, 
Oh. There you go. But yeah, I have a um, arts and crafts section. I love looking at people's stuff. It's like my favorite. <laughs> it totally is. Ooh. top down below I'm wondering if i'm painting this enough back here because i need to wait what did i do here oh i did it white i'm wondering if i should have done it black i'm gonna have to look at that later on okay I might actually have to do it black. It's okay. I'll do that later. I'll see when I glue it together and see what it does. But yeah. Oopsies. We got one, two, three, four, five, six more to paint. And then I think I have to go back over some of it to make sure it looks good. Because, you know, can't have it looking like. Put it away, put it away, put it away now. Okay. So I gotta come up with some like patriotic um, makeup. Because our patriotic holidays are coming up. I don't know. I usually do one look every year, like a different look, but I feel like I've been using this. I've been, I need a little more of a wilder look, I guess. It's a little different. <laughs> put it away, put it away, put it away now.
Got a lot of this going on. Look at this. Beautiful, isn't it? Beautiful black. I love the black. The black is so pretty. Thanks, I read the rules and posted a couple of my in in OB or two twenty twenty drawings. Awesome, I cannot wait to see. And now I really need to get ready. <laughs> All right, have a good night. Again, thanks for coming. Much, much love to you. Sleep well. Good say good night. Say good night, my good friend. Maybe that might have to be. Uh, I still gotta figure it out. The word for sweetheart. Good night, my good friend. I could say good night, my good friend. I could do that. It has that same type of tone to it. I don't know yet. I'm still trying to debate on what I should use. Because I like to do that one song. Good night, sweetheart. Well, it's time to go. When people leave. <laughs> because I like it. And it's kind of fun. But I don't want to call people sweethearts. So I'm trying to think of another word to use instead of sweetheart. I might say good friend. Because y'all are friends. Maybe I'm just blind. Tell me when I'm here. Okay. Ooh. Put it like that. One more. One more. Tell me when I'm here. I thought I was going to fling that and it's going to get everywhere. I would have been like, oh, you wanted me to be. I'll never let you down. Even if I couldn't give up everything, it's probably for your good. Call me when I'm scared. Always will be there. Okay. All right. Well, I'll tell my friends. I've been uh, reading a a book. Um, well, I should say rereading. It's one of my favorites. Like, I wish they would turn that into a movie. But the problem with that is, like, you want a movie, and then they do crap, and then you're like, I wish they never did it into a movie. <laughs> but I feel like I would want to see how they would do this book you know what I mean all right let's get the red back to love me when I'm gone Ugh, this looks so disgusting look at this oh this is beautiful I just want to drink this don't you <laughs> Yeah, no, I don't think so. Maybe I'm just blind. I'm just totally putting the ink back into the brush. We have red. I think the red could probably be, I wonder if I could just paint the red on this tray and call it a day. Like. 
Probably, right? You would think so? Maybe. Possibly. I don't know. That way I don't have to, like, pick it up or whatever. I do not know. What would be the one you wanted me to be? Okay, I think that's what I'm going to try to do. Because, see, look. This one is a little wonky. Like this one right here, this one is like sticking like straight up. So like I should have done it like where it's flat. But yeah, I think I can just go like this on top, right? I don't think the sides really need to be done. It's just more of the top because that's the part that you'll see. Besides the fact that I have to do the bottom part too on some of these. So I might have to, but we'll just see. We'll, we're going to do it. So gross. Paint is so nasty. All right, here we go. That way you don't have to get as much black on it, maybe, possibly. I'll see. So far, so good. I need to do the tips, though, because they're looking a little like a hot mess. Yeah, because I didn't do them. That's how I got black on it. Okay, never mind. I'm seeing how I get black on it. Love and hate. Okay, this is all good. I should keep this away from my computer, to be honest, because... Yeah. Look at that. Look at the shine. And then I got to put a clear coat on top. Kind of, maybe I'll glue it down first and then I'll seal it because I don't want like, it might be easier to do it all. What do you think guys? I'm totally getting black, uh, red on that black, but I'll go over it. I'm tempted to do bla um glitter, to be honest, but, you know, I should probably leave it glitter-free. Or I could do glitter with a nail polish on the red. That might be cute, but that might also turn it a different color, because it's like a silver... What do you think? Or, oh, no, better yet, I could do it on the black. When it all comes down. What are your thoughts? Anybody having an opinion? Oh, let me get that black. Ah, I'm getting it all over. I am willy nillying it. I should just be kind of careful, but, you know. I got hair on it. Okay. That was faster, way faster than, oh wait, there's some, I need to get this part down here. Okay. Are you... Who is there to take your place? 
no one knows. Because I could totally, I know glitter will look really, the silver will look really good on the black. So maybe I'll do like the silver glitter on the black ones. I was also thinking about doing it on the can. I mean, I could try. Let me, I mean, I'm going to be covering, so I don't know if it's actually worth it or not. But we can test it while I let this minute dry for a minute. Now I have to clean my brush again. Uh, if I can find my nail polish. Uh, should be right here. Like I'm not going to go crazy. I'm not going to get too, too crazy, even though I want to, like deep down inside, you know? Like for real. See, I really do like using the glitter, the glitter, gl like glitter nail polish, because I feel like it gives it a better. Okay, let's see. And the glitter's not really getting all over. It's con it's like controlled. What do you think, guys? If I use UV activating like gel nail polish on like paper, would that is be the same thing as like a resin? Would it act somewhat similar to like a resin because it's UV'd or is it totally different? And would water penetrate it? Do you guys know? Anybody know? What do you think? Do we like that? I'm only going to do the trim to finish this up because it's already done. It was done is done, but... I guess I'm gonna have to figure. I guess I'm gonna have to play and see. But if if people know in advance, like if people already know, I don't want to play around. You know what I mean? Waste product if it's not gonna work either. But I guess that's that's the problem creating. I guess right? Trial and error. It's part of the name of the game. Okay. Okay. What do you think? Do we like that? I don't know. I don't know. Because I could totally just go like this. Like, do, 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 like, let me just glitterize the center in this one. I don't know. Ooh. That's some chunk. Chunkamunka right there. Nope, we're not doing that, are we? No. Nope. I don't know. Kind of cute in the in the inside like that. I mean, y'all not gonna see that really much anyway. But we'll just continue it because that's how we roll here. Okay. Anyway, we're just going to do it that way and so say we did it right. Okay, so I need to change this to red. I mean, worst case scenario is I just cover that can back with black paint. It's really not no big deal. 
All right, so we're gonna do black again. And I'm just gonna do it like this. There we go. Cover that red up. And there we go. Oh yeah, this is good. Yeah. Oh, this one has the red. Hey, sorry, next song. There you go, that's better. Okay. I like the glitter on it actually to be to be honest. Oh you too. Good night. With sting and sweat. Okay. Okay. You're like, okay. Now I'm gonna let this. We need to smooth that out a bit. All right, we're gonna let this dry. I think we're good on paint. I don't know if we should do this one. Do we like the glitter or not? I feel like that's a lot, isn't it? Oh, it's too late. Well. It's going to be covered, so I'm not too worried about it. I'm going to let this dry in a quick jiffy before I glue some of it on. Oh, wait. Oh, shoot. Shoot, 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 shoot. Oh, well. It's okay. It's going to be towards the bottom of the can, so it's not going to matter. And I need to plug in my glue gun because why not? Okay. I don't need these right now. I wonder if I should just throw them away. I'm going to hold on to them for a second. Um, I am going to need... Oh yeah, the water base seal and protect. That's what I have. This it's like a wax. It's right here. So I'm not done with paint. I should find my other paintbrush, to be honest. Because I feel like I don't want to keep using the same one. I wonder if I have it. I don't have it in there. I thought I had it on the floor. We're going to look and see if it's going to be up here. No, it's not. Ooh. That 
was not good. I found, I have my, uh, Nightmare Before Christmas <laughs> cups. Got them at Halloween. And then I found my, I have my Hocus Pocus one too. I love this one. But yeah, it's not having my brushes in there. I guess I'm going to have to wash this one and do it. Uh, I thought I had like four or five of them. What I probably did was um, I probably did not clean it. And I probably didn't end up cleaning it and I probably ended up like probably ended up getting ruined and I probably threw it away that's probably what happened to him it's exactly probably what happened because it should be like right here oh well I'm gonna have to use this You know, he ain't gonna die. All right, I'm gonna have to be right back, guys. So if anybody comes in, if y'all watching, I'll let them know. I'll be right back. I'm uh, gonna clean out the water, get a new cup of water, and yeah, I'll be right back. I'm back. Um, I got a new. Well, I didn't get a new. I cleaned it. So. All right. This is going to be a seal. Let that dry for a minute. 
And I'm going to get this ready. Oh yeah, the clue's ready. Yay. All right. Here we go. We're gonna do. We start off red, black, red, black, red, black. Which one first? Probably need to not see my. There you go. Probably red because we just painted the black, right? I'm assuming that's what we're gonna do. Close that down. So I'm only going to do these two, I guess, because these don't really glue down. It's good to know. But I am going to shoot some glue right there, like this, because because it's a little raised. Okay. All right. I'm gonna do black. I almost like that glitter in between, to be honest. So we need to do it like right here. Like globs of it. Um, how different part should we do it? Like this? That looks like a good, decent amount of part, right? Yeah, I think that's... Oh, it's got the webs. I hate the webs. Although the glitter in between is kind of cool. I'm not gonna lie. But you know me and glitter, so like. Look at that. So getting heavy so it's like oh. all right here we go again we should do right
feel like this needs to be moved over a little more, although it's stuck now. Not too bad. Just okay. I feel like I need to add like that so I can do it that way. So it's still a little wet. Right. We need to do it close. Yeah, I think that's too much space, to be honest. It's probably going to set my stuff up for... Ooh. Oh, is it going to break? No, okay. I'm going to have to do it, scoot it over. Which means that puts that one in a bad place as well. So we're going to just move these closer. Pass this rail until my heart open. Okay. Tear my elbows and sew myself shut. I care too much. Okay, we're going to do this again. Oops. Let's not do it upside down because, yeah, I'm not doing this again. How does this look? That looks better, right? Quickly, before it glue dries. Okay, there. Okay. Why don't you just go home? All right, I'm just gonna leave it. All right. Okay, we're gonna do it like this. Ooh. All right, let's move this over real quick. There we go. I like it. What do you think, guys? Do you like it too? I sew myself shut. I don't know if that's string. Probably is. But it's hard to get off because my nails. There you go. All right, we're going to do it. And then we need uh, a black. Because why the hell not, right? Oh yeah, I need a glue stick too. Lucky for me, I have one right here. 
Pull that out of my you know what? No, I'm just kidding. Back pocket, you dirty minds, you. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Honey, are you okay? Are you okay? Are you okay, honey? Ow. A smooth criminal. This is where you think like paper towel is not probably a best idea because of all of this BS in right here. But That's hurt like um meow 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 meow. Uh, no, 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 okay. Ow, okay, Center. Okay. Ah, uh, this is gonna freaking yep. It's busted. I need to do this again, lovely. Do I not have enough glue on that? I mean, I'm coating the crap out of it. You would think it would be fine, but whatever. There you go. I wonder if, like, that hurts. Does that hurt, Ken? Oh, poor thing. Just kidding. Um, black. If you love me. You won't be here with me. Paper towel's got to go. But I think I am going to do white, no black on all. Should I do black on? Yeah, I probably should do black on the inside to make it look like a cohesive thing like I did here. See here, I did it all white to kind of have that same look. So... I'm probably going to end up doing it on this, too. Unless y'all come up with the reason why not, but I think that's what I'm going to do. I think, I think, I think that's what I'm going to do. Go about right here. Let's 
sick with shame. Oh, no, 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 yep, up, a little more up. Nope, did I do it right? It's barely on the brim, okay. I'm like, ooh. So don't cry to me if you love me. Oh, I need to scoot that up a little bit, just a little. Okay, there we go. What do you think? Pretty cool, right? It would be kind of cool if I was able to like uh, round edge it, but I'm not gonna get all that fancy because, you know. Okay, a little closed. Well, that's right, right there. I keep slipping farther. Okay, we're going to do it this way. There you go. I don't know if that's going to work or not. I'm trying to get that glue off. A little better so it doesn't look like it's a hot mess, right? Ow, mother freaking nature. Okay, there we go. Now we need to do the red. Like I wanted to sometimes like shove a thing of glue like all under here, but I'm not gonna do that. I think it'd be fine. Okay, so looks like it's a good little spot for this. I feel like this is not going to stick.
feel like I should shove glue down there. Like, see what I mean? It's lifting. That should help. Ooh, the can's warm now. It's kind of funny how the hot glue is that hot. Like, it warmed the inside of the can. Yeah, I think I'm going to just paint that all black. But yeah. Oh, look at you, so pretty. Okay. I need to do this a little more like that. There we go. What do you think? Hello, Ace. How art thou? What is up with thee? I'm doing all right. Are you ready for the weekend? Happy Friday. Unless you're not, unless you're not, um, <laughs> unless you're not on the Eastern time zone. Could still be not. It could not be uh, midnight yet for you. <laughs> I'm glad to hear it. I'm doing well. Just got back a few hours ago from seeing the Long Island medium pizza. Oh, nice. Anything good? Oh, you are? Okay, you are on Easter time zone. I wasn't sure if you were or not. Because I'm like, oh, you might not be midnight yet. <laughs> might not be a new day yet for you. Did the medium give you any good whatever you were looking for? If that's what if I'm understanding your comment, right? It was a full audience. She didn't get get to me, but I saw how it helped others have closure. So it was nice. Oh, okay, okay. Well, 
Well, that's good. I mean, it sucked that she didn't get to you, but it's good that you saw that she helped others, so. I think look, this looks freaking freaking cool, right? I do know a medium who travels to the conventions I go to, and he does things more privately. Oh, I see. Yeah. There are some that do it privately, some that do it like one-on-one, um, -on -one, some do it like in groups. You dig how it looks? Yeah, I think it's turning out good. Even if I did glitter I, the can a little bit, just because why not, right? I wanted to see if nail polish would, would seal it pretty well. I don't think it gave me my answer, but it's okay. On a Sunday morning, banging my head. Oh, by the way, did you dig the creep show song? I have not. Um, I'm trying to figure out how to do it, like put it in as a command. I'm really bad at that, so I'm really. I I have it. I haven't listened to it yet, but I need to. Um, I haven't forgotten about it. I just don't know how to do it. If you have any ideas on how to do it, let me know. Or a link that I could watch a video to how to do it. <laughs> like, I, I was going to um, message you about that, like, later. But since you brought it up. I could ask one of my Twitch streamer friends. Yeah, if you could, that would be awesome. Um, yeah. So I'm not sure if I know how to, like I can do the sound. Um, I did the sound, what is it called? The sound, um, what is that app? Whatever it is, the sound, whatever you make sounds on there through um what is it through um twitch <laughs> Ugh, my gosh but um uh, for a command i don't know because i use nightbot i don't know yeah if you can just see if they know or a video i can look up and do it i can probably figure it out i just need a i just need a little guidance and then i will be able to do put that on there for you I feel bad because, like, you redeemed that, like, a little while ago, a couple weeks ago, and I have not done it, but I have not forgotten. <laughs> no, don't, don't do that. I don't want that done. Oh, is it going to be, uh, I kind of want to end it like that, but I don't think it's going to work. It's going to end up being two. Oh, hey, Darth, I haven't seen you in a hot minute. Are you all right? Are you doing okay? 
I mean, you don't have to answer me. I'm being nosy, of course, but hi, welcome in. Good to see you. Um, what streamer tool are you using? Uh, Streamlabs. Yeah, Streamlabs OBS. Oh, I finished watching Critical Role. Oh, did you? How was it? I'm sorry you're not okay. I hope I can at least make you smile for a quick minute or two or three. May or maybe f help you forget your your day or your week or your month or your year or whatever you need. Is that why you've been silent? I haven't seen you on here because you're just not doing so well. Again, you don't have to answer me. I'm being nosy. Why is there glitter on this? Did it just fall off? It totally did. Uh, you. I wonder if I should just move it over so I wouldn't have to. No, because then that would be a little weird, wouldn't it? If I moved that a little closer, that a little closer, I could probably fit. Hold on, let me see if this is going to work. Because I really don't want to do two colors of the same color back to back. That bothered me when I did it on the other one, but I had no choice. This one, I might not have a choice now because it's not budging. And it's breaking all over. Great. Oh, no. You dag nabiter. You fuddy duddy. You piece of filth. You know what I might do? Just do another. I have enough, I think. Okay, so if I did it like this, I don't want to have it doubled. So if I did this, did this one, right? Um, did, is that pushing it? That's pushing it, isn't it? Freaking dragon. Because I don't want to do it too close, but I don't want the double. I might have to do the double. It might just be an odd thing. If I did it like this, I feel like that's a little too... See? That's a little too much. I posted a YouTube video about using channel points to have sound alerts in your Discord. Okay, thank you. Like, is it the sound? Because I use the sound. Because I have channel point um, sounds. I just don't know how to upload. Or or, or does it matter? Because I do have, like, you can redeem sounds on my on my thing. So is it the same way how I did that? Only upload your own? Or is there like, I feel like there's some like project or some like to do for it. Or am I just literally making it harder than it really is? Because I'm known to do that as well. It's going to have to be double. That That's major bummage. Because I have, oh, sound alerts is what I have on my thing. Unless it's a totally different thing.
The video explains a website that links to your Twitch account and it connects to each other. You would have to find and upload your own sound files to this website and four viewers of your Twitch can redeem the sound. Okay, so it does explain it. I'll, so I'll just watch the video then. Yeah, because um, Ace sound, sound Alerts can work too. Oh, can it? Okay, because Ace redeemed a, a sound command on the thing, and I just don't know how to put it on, because I've never done with sound. I've done it with, like, like comments, like, oh, like a, like, G, holy G will occur. Like, someone added, like, a holy G will occur, a command. You know what I mean? So, like, everybody can use that command. But I never done it with sound, so I didn't know how to do that. Does that make sense? You just have to upload the file to sound alerts. Okay. Because, yeah, because he made me a sound. I just need to put it up there. I just didn't know how to do that. Or if you know what I mean. I like to repeat myself, so I'm going to just zippity doo da zippity a out the door for this, so. And yes, I did just shove this stick up my mouth for a minute. <laughs> it went right in there. I over explain. In my head, I like, the problem with me sometimes is I over explain. But the reason why I over explain is because like, I feel like it didn't sound, it didn't come out right in my head. And then I try fixing it and then it makes it 10 times worse. <laughs> so yeah. So I spend the time trying to fix it and it doesn't work. Gonna have to be double. I don't like it doubled. Why, oh, why, stop with me? We're on a Medicaid, Medicaid. Okay, but I will, I'll give that a try, Darth. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh my god. Like ripping candy from a baby. Jeez Louise. Since you have sound alerts, I removed the other video and linked you you other video wait, wait, wait since you have sound alert i removed the other video and linked you other other video okay to watch okay awesome thank you thanks for looking out i'm still trying to learn things i learn something new every time i stream there's like i feel like there's so much and I'm like, la di da, la di da. I'm like, I don't know how to do that. And I guess I need to learn how to do things, you know what I mean, too. Um, I usually just count on people to do it for me, but that's not really teaching me, right? Um, I need to learn these things, so. But I do get confused easily. But it sounds simple enough, so I can figure that out. I'm not. I'm not like oblivious, <laughs> you know what I mean? Okay, I'm gonna totally get a new one because I'm not doing the glue. Ew, this is wet. Hey, Siri, next song.
Okay. It's going to be doubled. I don't like it. No, it's not. <gasps> did I fix it somehow? No, I did not. This must have popped off. Okay. It's going to be doubled. That makes me a sad. Me a sad, sad, sick gal. No, I'm just kidding. It is. No. Hard to find. <gasps> oh, it's hot. Yeah, I stumbled across um sound alerts like like a month ago or a month and my maybe two months ago. When I did, um, right before I did, um, the, um, Easter, no, was it the last thing from, um, Pickle Puss's event? Was it Easter? I think it was Easter. I think that was the last, that was right before when I found out about Sound Alert. Okay, so now I'm going to have to add the red back in over here. You think you can keep on going, living like a king. Okay. What do you think? I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. Oh. I'm going to have to seal it. Paint the inside of this because... Jeez Louise, man. Damn freak. 